Hi there! In this tutorial, I will show you how to make a beautiful flamingo brooch embroidered with sequins, beads, and crystals. You will need felt, leatherette, cardboard, size 10 seed beads, 2 mm crystal beads, 5 mm sequins, droplet crystal bead, a piece of lace, glue, monofilament, needle, and scissors. You can find this stencil in the description down below. Cut one meter of monofilament and fix it on the felt. I make a small stitch on the back side of the felt, then another stitch in the same place. Wrap the monofilament around the needle two to three times and tighten it well. Additionally, you can tie both tails into several knots. String 1 sequin. I pass through the felt top down and then down up. String the next sequin and pass your needle through the hole in the previous sequin. The next sequin.
14 sequins in total. Cut a piece of lace for the flamingo's tail. I will sew this droplet crystal with special holes for the flamingo's wing. Pass with the needle through the holes in the sequins and string one size 10 seed bead. Two millimeter crystal bead for the eye. For the beak, I string two white seed beads and pass through the felt near the last seed bead. Then pass through the felt before the last seed bead and enter this last seed bead. and so on.
Crystal bicone bead. The legs are embroidered with 2 millimeter crystal beads. The cardboard must be 2 millimeters smaller than the embroidery. Cut about 1.5 meters of monofilament and pass with a needle through all the layers, leaving a 7 centimeter long tail. Pass in the same place again, wrap the monofilament around the needle 2 to 3 times and tighten well. String one seed bead and pass through all the layers in the same place. Pass through this seed bead with a needle down up and tighten well. String the next one seed bead and pass through all the layers 1 to 1.5 millimeters farther. and pass through this seed bead down up.
At the end, tie both tails into several knots. Thank you for watching. I'll be grateful if you subscribe to my channel.